You guys, I am so aggravated right now because I filmed this video days ago and it was when I had everything in front of me and I was all, I had, I just went to edit it now and I can't find the footage. I think I accidentally deleted it when I deleted the, like the raw footage from my last video that I did and now I'm just like, ugh. I want to hit myself because I can't believe I did that. So the problem is that this was a swap video that I did with my friend Ashley. We did the Halloween swap together and then we decided we were going to do a Christmas swap too. And she got me a ton of stuff and now I feel like I'm missing stuff because, well I know I'm missing stuff because for one she made me a bunch of stuff that I already used um, so I can't show it to you and I just like I can't jog my memory and remember what I'm missing because I put everything away because I had already filmed this video and now I feel bad because of friggin I'm missing stuff <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna show you everything I do have here um, I'm gonna link her video below also because she uploaded hers yesterday so I'm hoping I can get mine up within reasonable timing I want to get it up today I'm hoping I don't delete this footage um, but I'm gonna show you everything uh, she had made me, where, she sent me, uh, two separate packages first, because she did, like, a 12 Days of Christmas thing for me, and then she had these made, which is so cute. This is, a, uh, an oven mitt. It's black, and it says Merry Christmas Meg on it with Jack and Sally, and then to go with it, this little glass, hopefully you can see, I think you can see, that has the same design on it. Um, oh, she also got me leggings that I didn't grab because those are in the wash. They have, um, they're kind of like galaxy, I don't know why I'm pointing to this, I have pajama pants on right now, but they're kind of like a galaxy print with Jack and Sally on the sides. They're really comfortable, super soft. Um, she got me this super cute, like, sleep shirt. This is, it says Happy Halloweeny. It's got the little wiener dogs on it. This is made from the same super soft material as these pants here. <laughs> I also have these pants in this print. So that's so cool because this is like the most comfortable material. I love it. And this came with glittery black and orange fuzzy socks too that are super soft that are also in the wash right now. Um, so at least you can see that I've been using the stuff that she sent me because everything's like in use right now. Um, she sent this super cute ornament that's been hanging on my tree since I got it. It's Jack Skellington with a big head. His head is like the size of a normal Christmas tree ball. Then his little body's on the bottom. Super cute. I don't want to break him, so I'm putting him away from the glass. Um, and then she sent these pajamas that I have been wearing them every night. They're so comfortable. They are so soft and fuzzy. These are also Nightmare Before Christmas, and the shirt has Jack on it with a Santa hat, and it says, No Sleep Till Christmas, which you can bet your butt I'm going to be wearing them even though it's after Christmas now because these are so nice and warm at night. And the pants match, of course, and they have Jack heads all over them and little stars and snowflakes. They're so soft. It's like a, like wearing a blanket, like a super cuddly blanket, because they're so soft. Alright, um, I have such like a, a mess of stuff here. Oh, it's keeping with the Nightmare Before Christmas theme. She also got me this really nice cup with a plastic straw. Um, this was cool. I told her I had a cup that I had been using constantly that had peeps from Easter. It had like peeps on it and it broke on me. It cracked down the side. So I'm super excited that I got a new one. This is my new favorite cup. Um, and then she made me a bunch of stuff as well. This was way prettier when it was brand new, but I've been using it, which is why it's on a paper, uh, not a paper towel, a face cloth. It was, it looks like a pie. It's cold processed soap and it's cherry scented which cherry is my favorite everything it's got little cherries on top it smells so good I smell yummy when I get out of the shower with that um, she sent two little uh, bubble scoops 
which are kind of like, um, they're kind of like bubble bars. They work the same way. And these were, see, I don't have the bag. These were cinnamon, cinnamon donut, I think. Cinnamon sugar donut. It smells just like cinnamon sugar. So there's little like squares and it looks like frosting on the top. They're really cute. I had bought some from her last sale that were cherry snow. Or cherries in snow, something like that. Oh, they smelled so good and I've already used them both. So I'm glad she sent me a couple more. And then this is a bubble bar shaped like a heart. And I believe this is the cherry snow scent too. It smells like it. Haven't used this one yet. I've been using all her other stuff. She also sent me a bath bomb that I already used. It was shaped like a Christmas tree and it was key lime scented. This is just a little heart. It smells really good. And then she made so much more stuff and I've used a ton of it. <sighs> so I can't show you everything and I feel bad. Um, this is one of her lotion like body butter super thick lotions I love how thick it is it's so nice I've been using this one you don't need a ton it's such a nice thick lotion this is blackberry and tonka bean scent which is another one of my favorites it smells so good it's kind of like a men's cologne scent but it's light it's not like super overpowering and I've been using so much lotion lately anyways because my hands are so dry from being in water all the time and like constantly washing stuff. Um, but I love her lotion. And she also made me a peppermint bubble bath. It is red with like little green flecks in there. I don't know if you can see. It's like pinkish red. I need to try it. Oh, it was open and I just... But it smells so good. Oh, that's another thing I forgot. She gave me a lotion in a little pump bottle that had a peppermint scent to it, too. It was like, I believe it was Twisted Peppermint from Bath & Body Works, like the same type of scent. I just get some of that on me, and I smell like a candy cane. It smells so good. Um, she sent me an e.l.f. cream eyeliner in, uh, what's the, Teal Tees. I haven't broken into this one yet because I haven't really been doing my makeup, but... Um, I'm excited to try that out. I've never tried any of their cream eyeliners before. I've had the pencil ones, but not the cream. Um, and then she sent me a Sex Kitten Tarte, um, what do you call it, eyeliner. And my reaction when I opened this was so funny because I turned it around and I was like, oh my god, I didn't realize that it has a little kitten on the top of it. That is so adorable. And I've used this a couple times already. It's got a super sharp point it's like a felt tip pen and it goes on so smoothly this is like my new favorite eyeliner um she sent me this palette it is b by bubs beauty whoa i almost just stuck my finger in there and i haven't even had a chance to use this yet but it's really pretty it's got like mostly neutrals with some purples down there really pretty actually i want to take this off if i can Oh my goodness I have lotion on me now so I can't I'll do this later <laughs> but that's a really pretty palette and then for like the 12 days of Christmas thing that she sent me it all came in a little AOA studio bag and I will just go through because nothing's in any particular order because I just opened everything but she had them all wrapped with like day one day two day three and Aiden opened some of them on me so then they were out of order for a couple days but the first thing here is an AOA Studio F13 brush. It is so soft. Super soft, like blush or highlighter brush, whichever you want to use it for. It is like small enough that you can use it for highlighter, use the corner of it. Um, then there is this Spectrum Rainbow Veil, that's what it's called. I was looking for the name. It is a, you can use it, oh, oh my god, I'm sure you can use it as eyeshadow too, but it's one of the rainbow highlighters, super pretty, I lost the little plastic, there we go, um, this is a Rimmel Brow This Way Shape and Fill 
Uh, one of them looks like a cream and one of them is a powder. Boom, boom, boom. Hoping my camera is going to be focused. Um, an AOA wedge sponge. It comes with four little triangle sponges. Or wedge sponges, I should say. Um, this is M Princess Eyeshadow in the color Pretty Petal. This is a loose eyeshadow and it's so pretty. Hold on, let me see if I can open it for you guys. This is one of those colors that's like a peachy pink with a gold sheen to it. I love shades like this, especially for all over the lid. Hopefully you can see it. The sun is kind of bright shining through the window, but I don't know if that's even in focus. Maybe I should be back here more. I think that's better. Um, that's super pretty. Would have gone good with the eyeshadow I have on today, actually. I should have used this on my lid. Um, and then this is a matte, a wonder matte liquid lipstick from AOA Studio in the color Blessed. A really pretty pink. Kind of like a corally pink shade. And then we have Thank Me Later Face Primer. And there is, this eyeshadow is so nice and smooth. This is from Elizabeth Mott. Pop Goes the Shadow in the color Gunmetal. It's like a really pretty taupey shade. And then there's an AOA Wonder Baked eyeshadow in Neptune. This is like a violet bluish purple. And this is a Halo highlighter from AOA Studio in Sunstone. This one is like a golden beigey shade. It's got like it's like a beige with gold veining through it. So pretty. And this is another Wonder Baked highlighter. Um, this one is the color, what's the name of this one? Cloud. This is a shimmery white one. This is beautiful. I wore this one yesterday. I don't have any highlighter on today, actually. I can probably, I don't have a mirror in front of me, but I can use the brush to put some of this white shade on. Let me see. There's a mirror in here, right? Oh, that's pretty. I don't know if you're going to be able to, can you see it, the light hitting me? That's such a pretty color. It's just white, but like, shows up really well. Kind of hard to put highlighter on when I have my glasses on, but if I don't have them on, I can't really see good. It's so pretty. It's a very, like, subtle but when the sun hits it, it's super shimmery. Okay, so that's the white one. And then there's one left in here. This is a blush, Lumi Baked Blush. Lumi Radiant Blush, but it is a baked blush. This is in the color Wine. This is like a, it's got the beige base, but it's got like rose and pink shimmery veining through it. So I think that was everything that was in here. Did I take stuff out? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No, I think I had everything in the in here because I kept it all together. But I know that I'm missing some of the stuff that she sent me, and I'm gonna be kicking myself because I can't believe that I. When I first unboxed the main box, I was filming it. So, like, I had my genuine unboxing reactions, and I'm so bummed that I got... I don't know what I did with the, the footage. I had to have deleted it by accident, because I just looked through every folder on my computer that has my videos. It wasn't in another one by accident. I just... I don't know what I did with it. So, I just filmed this again. I know I missed some stuff, and I'm mad at myself because I know there's other stuff she sent. There's stuff that I already used. Um, 
like the bath bomb and there was a couple of other things. <sighs> but <laughs> I really enjoyed doing this swap with her. I hope we can do another one in the future. We have like probably not enough time to do a Valentine's Day one, but we could probably do an Easter swap. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this, even though I forgot some stuff. <laughs> but um, I'm going to link Ashley's video below so you can head on over to her channel and see the stuff I got for her. And I will talk to you guys in my next video.